Okay, we are going into medium flat rate box two of my bulk buy. Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. Full time reseller. All right, let's get started and I have separated it into items I'm going to sell. Crafters items, which are there, and also um, items that I'm gonna lot and sell as a lot. So, um, let's start with the stuff I'm gonna sell. That's usually the most fun, right? And as I go through this, I may end up tossing some of this stuff into small lots or I may end up tossing it in a big bag that I end up selling in bulk. I don't know. This is just my first round of sorting. There was some neat stuff in this box actually that I'm kind of excited to show you guys. Um, this is just like a wood uh, cross and it's just wood beads. It's, I mean, it's, let's see, made in Taiwan. I mean, it's nothing big. But I thought maybe somebody would want it. So it'd be a bread and butter item. Um, let's see. Let me see if I can. This is seed beads. And it's really, um, it's cute. Let me see if I can get my mannequin thing here. Um, I don't think it's actually. Uh, I'll just see if I can hold it in place and show you guys. So it's gonna fit like, ah, you get the point. Kind of like an apron. So sorry, I didn't have it clasped, but it'll hang in the front. I think it's really neat. So I'm gonna sell that separately. This one is really neat also. And again, I don't have it latched in the back, but it is a seed bead necklace also, which is super, super, Super neat. I have no idea if this is like, looks like a modern clasp, but um, I don't know. I just think it's a neat piece. So I'm gonna sell that. This is super fun, this little guy. I think it's Betsy Johnson if I remember correctly. Yeah, Betsy Johnson. So I'm gonna sell that separately. I think someone will buy it. Um, I really like stuff like this. Um, it, it's a flower. I'm guessing that's probably vintage, but it's a really neat piece. I'm gonna sell that separate. Uh, I'm just gonna show you some of the highlights. I think this might be a shell and I probably need to be careful with this because it seems kind of delicate, but isn't that cute? I think it's really cute. I think I can sell it. So I'm gonna sell that separate. And let's see. Again, this piece is super heavy and I don't know, I think I can sell it. <laughs> I'm so not good with jewelry and values and stuff like that. This is just like a glass pendant. I thought this ring was kind of neat. Uh, this is cute. I sold all of my other um, animal wood necklaces. This one, I don't know if this is some sort of clay it kind of looks like Play-Doh, <laughs> dried Play-Doh, but it's probably dried clay. But there's a cute little elephant and zebra, a little tiger, and then this cute, adorable giraffe. So definitely gonna list this. I think it's probably, somebody made it, handmade probably. Can't say for sure, but it still has this on it. So I don't know if somebody had it like at a craft show or something, but it's super cute. Um, this is one of those spinner rings. I, I I may lock the rings up. I haven't decided. There was a whole bunch of rings in this set. Um, that one's kind of cool. I need to, oops, sorry. I need to go through and kind of maybe uh, look at them again because I just kind of threw them in the pile. There's a little turtle pendant. This is, I don't know what, I don't know what this is made of. Do you guys know? Because I found a lot of this. This one's kind of fun. I'll definitely list this separate. I don't know. It kind of looks like Betsy Johnson, but this one is not marked, but it's kind of cute. 
Kind of goes with that puppy dog. They'd be cute together. Uh, this is kind of fun. This deer, it's a pendant. I don't know what this is. It looks like a mood ring or something, but it's uh, adjustable, so it's just cheap. Here's another one of those. I want to say, I was thinking maybe that one. No, I don't know why I thought it was marked, but it's really cute. My camera's not really focusing very well. There we go. I think that's cute. I don't know why this is in the bag, so I just threw it over here. It's a butterfly. This is like one of those stretchy rings. This is glass pendant. I think this might be shell. Um, okay, I'm in love with this ring. How cute is that elephant? Oh my gosh, I love it. It's so cute. I don't know. I just think it's cute. I can't get it off my finger now. Ah, sorry. But yeah, super adorable. Um, I can't remember if it had any markings in it or not. Yeah, no, I don't see anything. But it's really cute. What do you guys think? Cute? Cuteness. Definitely selling that one separate. So I got these three blingy blings. And they're big and bulky costume, you know. But I really think I can sell all of those. This is definitely going to sell. It's a Batman ring. I've done really good with my DC comic uh, necklaces that I had. They sold really fast. Um, that says something on the back. I can't see. Oh, maybe it says Avon. That's just junk. There's a little bell. Again, I'll probably end up lotting up some of this stuff. This one, I believe, is a Savor Savorsky crystal. Is that what you call it? It's got the swan on the inside. I did look this one up. It has uh, decent comps. It's a harder to find ring. It's not super, um, super common. I think it's an older discontinued ring. Let me see if I can show you. Can you see the swan in there? Oh, no. It's on the other side, I think. Anyway, it has a swan, and that's how you know that it's, uh, I think it's, I'm, I know I'm probably saying it wrong, Saworski so, so, so <laughs> crystal. Oh, you guys can't see my face, but you know it's me because I can't pronounce anything. Here's another spinner ring. This looks like some sort of handmade pendant. Like, I don't know if that's shell that it's on, but it's kind of interesting. I don't know. Another, just a bunch of rings. This one's kind of neat. Um, might look into that one, maybe selling it separate. Again, I'll probably be lotting up a lot of the rings, selling them in bulk. This one's kind of cool. I do want to sell some stuff individually because I want to make, you know, I want to make some money. I like this one too. It's a snake. How fun is that? So I'm gonna sell that one separately for sure. This again, it looks like it's kind of on a shell maybe. I don't know, it's so hard to say, but that's kind of a statement piece type pendant. Um, just looking to see if I could see any markings. So I might sell that separate. There's this cute little flip flop. These are clip on earrings. They're uh, just Talbots. Another ring. Oh, that says something made in China. Ha <laughs> ha A uh, little butterfly ring costume. I mean, all this is just costume jewelry, you guys. But you can make money on costume jewelry for sure. It's just a matter of how much time I want to invest in trying to list it all when I have all of the inventory that I already have. Oh, that, that might look cool together. Maybe I'll try to sell that together. Kind of looks the same. Maybe not. I think that's a cute bracelet. Some bling, but it's a, a, I don't know. It's got, um, what do you call that? It's like a thing that keeps it, um, makes it fit. It's like an adjuster. I don't know. I can't remember if that one was marked or not. Yeah, it's got something in there. I can't remember what. So again, I'll, I'll take a better look. This is like one of those wrap bracelets and it's in really nice condition. I might try and sell that. This is like a crazy ring. This is super cute. It's a little owl pendant. 
think people like owls. I think this is a monster high. Not 100% sure on that. I'm not sure why I have this in here. Um, oh yeah, it's Black House White Market. I don't know, I might try to sell that separate. I might just end up throwing that in a lot. This is one of those necklaces that just goes around the neck. Same with this one. This is kind of neat. I don't know why. I, I tried to, like I said, I'm trying to keep some of the stuff out to list separately just to kind of build up my posh closet and have some different stuff. Um, a lot of it I'll probably just end up throwing in small lots or whatnot. So there's a little ring. Uh, this is ah still on a ch this. I don't know. I just thought maybe since it was still in the package, it's brass. I might check that out. Here's a little horse ring. It's a stretch ring. It's kind of fun. I may try to list that. Again, some of these things might bring people into my closet that might buy something else. That's what I like about Poshmark. Um, eBay, this stuff, you know, it, I say it's more saturated and harder to sell, but I've actually sold some jewelry. I don't know what this is. It's some sort of ring. It's kind of funky. I don't know, like part of me kind of likes it. Looks like maybe it's part of a spoon. So a little ring. This is like a little charm. It's got like a, you know, it goes on like a bracelet or something. It's a puppy dog. It's kind of cute. I think I showed you guys that. I don't know what this is. It's another one of those stretch rings. Maybe I'll make a lot of stretch rings. This is a butterfly and it's like, I think it's made out of glass. This piece is kind of cool. Again, I'll probably lock the pendants up. This piece, I kind of like this. Um, I'm definitely gonna try and sell it separately. It's just got a different, unique statement piece look to it. It's kind of heavy. I can't remember. It is Stella and Dot. And Stella and Dot, I have, when I've looked up comps, they're decent. This is kind of cute. Um, I might try to sell that one separately. Um, Enforce, don't know what that is, but it's cute and it's heavy. I don't know. That looks kind of old. So I just did a quick sift. I'm like parted things out like sell, keep, sell, keep, not sell, keep, like sell in a lot or sell separate. And this is kind of where I was thinking I would sell some of this separate or in small lots. Like I have no idea why this is in here. I'm not gonna sell that separate. This I'm kind of on the fence about. I don't know, I thought maybe somebody would like that. It's just, a, it's silver. I don't know, I don't think it's marked or anything, but it's, it's kind of heavy. I may end up just throwing that in with the, a lot of stuff. Again, I'm not sure. These are just a bangle. This piece I think is pretty cool. I, I'm not sure if this is a vintage clasp or not. It might be, but I was just drawn to it. I thought it was kind of cool looking. So I think I'm gonna list that just because I like it. This says Luke Bryan and it's some sort of like, I don't know if it's leather or what. Is he like a singer, like a country music singer or something? But it's still in the package, so I thought I'd look it up. Lenny and, oh, I can't remember. I texted someone about this because I could not remember and I was familiar with it, but I think it's some sort of direct sales. Is it Lenny and Eve or Evie or something like that? I, ha I saved it in my phone, but I have found a bunch of this stuff. And I think that I can do okay with this piece. So I'm definitely gonna list that by itself. This still has a, a tag attached, but it's just a bangle. I may do like a lot of bangles. Um, Alex and Ani, I have a whole bunch of Alex and Ani that I have found in all these boxes. I'm gonna set to this to the side and make like a lot of Alex and Ani. They're not in fantastic condition. That's the only thing. This is kind of cute. 
it's adjustable. It's just cheap, but it's still kind of cute. I don't know what this is. Fam Forever Family. I don't know. I think I can probably sell that for, I mean, even if I just sell it cheap. This is just a pendant. It's marked something. I can't read it. Pendant. Now, this is super cute. It's a nail. Again, stuff like this that's just different. Like, somebody's going to want this just because it's a nail. I'm going to sell that separate. I don't know about that. Um, these are really, really cute. Uh, and I'm going to say, I don't know if they're actually kids' bracelets, but I would say that they would fit a child, um, like, you know, 10 years old, 14 years old. Sorry, I'm trying to get it on my wrist. But it also stretches to fit me. So it's kind of one of those. But I got, I don't know if they're little stones or what they are, but I found a whole bunch of these. So I think I'm going to lot these in a lot and sell them. But like that one, I don't know why so much of the, the wire is showing. So I don't know. What do you guys think? Uh, here's another one. So it's got like the little stone on it. I think they're cute. I don't know why. I just think they're cute. This is a piece of glass that somebody has. This is just weird. This is, I mean, is that like not the creepiest looking cat you've ever seen? My ring lights on it. Um, let me see if I can. Yeah, it's weird. And like, if you wear it this way, it's like it's side. I don't know. I don't understand. I'm not sure why I left that out. Here's a little dolphin. Um, it's marked something, oh, uh, Hong Kong. It's just a dolphin. But, you know, I don't know. I'm Somebody might want that. This is really cute. It's really delicate. Uh, another ring here. So this is a sweater clip, and I have found so many sweater clips. So I'm going to put that to the side also, and I'm going to make a sweater clip pile, and I'm going to sell the sweater clips separately. I think I'm also going to do like pearls separately. So I'm making little piles as I'm looking through this. This is all um, breast cancer awareness pins. Um, they're, they're mostly pins and there's some bracelets. They also, you know, could double as like a hair thing maybe. Um, these little bracelets, they're super cute. So, I'll probably put those in my posh closet and maybe some people will bundle them with maybe something else they're buying. I may sell them in like a lot of 10 or something like that. They're really cute. Um, they've got the little walking feet. So I'm guessing they're from like a, you know how they have like the breast cancer where you go and walk. These are miscellaneous earrings that I am gonna put in the pile to look through with all the other miscellaneous earrings. All right, I need to move this stuff over so that it doesn't get mixed up with the next stuff I'm gonna get out, which is gonna be the wearable. So this is all wearable. And I'm probably going to pull stuff from the pile that I just showed you and add it into this bag and sell this as a lot. Like these things I had separate, I'm gonna add them in. And I'll just show you kinda what I'm thinking here. Um, this piece is really funky. You know, there's this. I've got some rings in here. I definitely want, this is kinda neat. That's kind of cool. It's got the peacock feathers. These are all wearable pieces. So I'm going, I think this bracelet's really cool. It's wood. I, uh, I want them to be lots where people can um, sell the stuff. This is a, uh, for a scarf, but it feels really cheap. So... This is just the earrings. I think it came with a necklace. This is a kind of a cool bracelet. I don't know if it's handmade or what, but it's really neat. I could probably sell that by its, I mean, there's a lot of stuff I could sell. 
that's a pendant. I just don't want to take the time. I'm not sure what this is. Let me see if I can get it. it it's got like a hole in the center and then it, um, it lays out like that. I don't know if it goes on your head. This little ring. This is kind of a neat piece too. It's got a uh, original tag of 18. It's pretty nice little ring. Just a stretch bracelet. Um, this is, it looks really weird, um, but it's seed bead, but it's on this really delicate, like, uh, yarn or whatever, uh, not yarn, like, what's that stuff you cross stitch with? It's really kind of neat. It looks, um, when it's all bunched together, it's pretty cool. This still has the tag on it. Uh, my style, lead free, new, I don't know, it's just some bracelet. These are in there, which is just... I mean, it's all costume this little skeleton thing this is a pretty piece um i don't know if it's marked or not it's not marked but it's cute so this piece just a little keychain so Again, I, I want to I want to make these lots like six to eight pounds probably. So I will. There's that other earrings right there. I will be adding to this. There's just that. This is like a little uh, seed bead uh, bracelet, which is pretty cool. Another little necklace, and there's some stuff that's just mixed in that I didn't actually pick up. So that is definitely going to be lotted and sold as a bulk purchase. I have, um, this is all the cracker stuff, which means the items are broken, tangled. Uh, I'm pretty sure that this bag was like, I got sick of un untangling it. Yeah, you can see it is just a tangled mess and I didn't want to deal with it. So I gave up and I'm sure that some of this is going to be wearable, but I don't want to mess with it. So um, yeah, that's crafters. And then there was this belt. And, uh, I think these are both belts. So I don't know if I'll throw that in like with that stuff or not, because it's not really jewelry. I could just put jewelry plus two belts. I don't know. So yeah, the stuff I'm most excited about are these items. This stuff will probably get put in with this stuff or made into small lots. Haven't decided yet, but yeah, thanks for watching and I'm going to move on to another box. Be sure to check out the description of the video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.